Welcome to this training. My name is Dave Ives, and I just want to spend some time with you just to share with you some of the support that's going to be available as a new partner to the team. Very often, most people miss this most important aspect of initially getting started, and that is using those around you to put you in a position of success. You see, we come from a background, usually, where we have to be independent. We've had to strive for that position up the corporate ladder. We've had to compete for that limited position of progression in a corporate structure. Here in this type of model, it's more about cooperation, collaboration, rather than competition. So you may have never heard of the term a three-way call or the value of a three-way call. And so I want to talk you through uh, momentarily about the benefits and the reasonings behind that. So first of all, you may have a various background. You may be a professional and uh, a corporate managerial position. You may be a traditional business owner. And no one's really ever wanted to assist you because you would be competition to them. Here, it's all about getting you small victories from the very beginning. And the best way to do that is as you are learning, as you're starting to orientate yourself, to navigate around the incredible resources and tools and platforms that will enable you to build a very long, sustainable residual income. It's about learning from those who have gone ahead of you. And so a three-way call is really fundamentally bringing someone else's experience, skill sets, and expertise as you get started because success loves speed and if someone waits till they are informed or educated enough to feel they can get going then time passes by so this is one of the only vehicles that you can actually earn as you learn by using other people to work on your behalf but it is that collaboration and cooperation because the people that we want to speak to are your connections. And your connections may not listen to a third party if that third party had approached them directly. But here's the synergy. They're your connections. They're people that you already have relationships with. They're people that you already have connection to. People that already trust you, that you have influence with. So by using those aspects that you bring to the table and then using the skill sets, the experience and the ability to communicate what we do on your behalf to those individuals, we can achieve success much faster. Because through that process of a three-way call, that person who's working with you is going to do a number of things they're gonna be able to be more educated and experienced to answer your prospects questions. You're just getting started, so you don't have your story yet. You may not have even done your blood test yet. You may not even tried the oil yet and seen the results. But using a third party, they can share their story, their results. So you don't have to have a story yet to start building your business. And they're going to be able to give your potential partner, your potential customer information because they know where to source it while you learn how to navigate. And they're going to be able to share not just verbally, but documentation, videos, content that will validate the information they are sharing to your potential prospect. And then because this person who will be helping you through these three-way calls they aren't emotionally attached to that individual. So they'll be able to position an invitation professionally to review further information, to maybe join you on a webinar, to maybe come to a physical event on your behalf. Because sometimes we don't want to cross that bridge of showing people and leading people we know. So bring a third party person in to be able to do that on your behalf. And they can obviously ask them if they're ready to get started. Would they like to become a customer? How would they like to position themselves and partner with you? So depending on the conversation and what that three-way call has been aligned 
to do. Maybe it's a customer call. Maybe it's a potential partner call. That third party individual will be able to have a call to action for your potential customer, your potential prospect, and they can do it on your behalf. Once you do have a customer and once you do have a potential partner, then we have welcome calls where you may have brought someone on, whether it be a customer or a partner, and you can bring in third party again to welcome them on their decision. Show them that there's additional support, both in a structure and personally hands on that they then can get the bigger picture of it's just not you. There's a team approach. And through those three way calls, as you learn, then you can watch and hear and see and get evidence of the process, the duplication, the system, the, the positioning, the resources. So as you are learning, we teach others by showing them, by doing it with them, which creates pure duplication. So success in your Zenzino business isn't about how good you are, but how we duplicate the basics and how good you are at duplicating the basics. And to do that, it's always best to learn what we need to do by letting someone else go to work for you on three-way calls. And so some of the things that we want to share with you, the importance of the three-way call is the purpose behind it. It's your connections, it's your information, it's your relationships. But that third party connection is all about positioning, edifying, and building trust. You see, you have your prospects. They trust you, whether it be a relationship, a work connection, a socially involved with uh, environments, um, gymnasiums, and or committees, and clubs, and you've got a relationship via a friendship. So they're your prospects. But as someone who doesn't know them, we don't have that trust, but your relationship can, via your edification of an introduction of that three-way person, can build that trust in that prospect of yours. So edification is very important, and it can be very simple. Here's your new prospect. We are going to speak to them together. You don't know everything about the business, maybe about the product, about the process, about the system, but you're excited. So you say to your prospect, John, hey, John, I've just aligned myself with a wellness company out of uh, Sweden. We're about to open the United Kingdom. The company did about 80 million euros in sales in 2019. I've just got started. I've done some research and I love what I see. And right now there's an opportunity for us to potentially do something here together and be successful. But I'm just getting started. So I'd like to send you a, initially a short video to give you an overview. And if you like what you see, John, I'd love to introduce you to one of the partners who are working alongside me. So that's something along the lines how you would get John's attention and get his permission to look at the information. You follow up with John. You ask John, John, what did you like best? John, it's exciting, isn't it? John, I, did you feel the same when I got shown this too? Whatever you, but the thing you do not ask John is, what do you think? Because John doesn't have enough information to make an informed decision. He's only just been teased. He's just got a little bit to wet his appetite. So John, so you go back to John and you say to John, John, I know you've watched the videos for a couple of minutes long. Interesting, isn't it? Why don't we explore this a little bit further? I've got a partner of mine who's been doing it a little bit longer, knows a little bit more about the opportunity and is more qualified to answer questions that you may have. 
I've been working alongside them for a week or two, or I've known of them for a period of time, or in the short period of time I've been with them, they've actually guided me to some incredible tools and resources. So that's where you start to edify. So John feels a little bit more comfortable of the purpose of the three-way call and what role that person that you are bringing in will play on your behalf. And so the call goes ahead, whether it be a conference call, Zoom's very good because it's a visual thing. John can see me and I can see John and we can see you. There's a connection. So we get on Zoom together, you introduce, you position it, and then you sit back and you start to listen to the conversation. You listen to the, the team and the support that are going to do the call for you and you learn, you take notes. You learn how the questions are answered or how the questions are guided to maybe a tool or a document or a point of reference. So you start to realize that you don't need to know everything, but knowing where the information is so you can source that is the key. So a third party call, a three-way call, is the way to get going with your key people. Why? If you wait for you to know everything, you will slow your growth down. If you start learning the basics and allow someone to go to work with you, then you start to put people on your side to actually invest their time, their experience, their knowledge, and their story on your behalf whilst you are creating your knowledge, you are gaining your experience and you are creating your story. Those who use three-way calling and learn how to position it effectively, most definitely have success faster because they realize it's about playing team. And one of the biggest advantages of a three-way call is that by doing a three-way call with John, and John gets excited, he sees the potential, he realizes it's bigger than you. There's resources and support and infrastructure beyond you. So John gets attracted to the community, the opportunity, the team. And here's the biggest aspect. John got excited by a three-way call. John joined because of a three-way call. John's going to be easier to work with lining up his three-way calls because that's how he got exposed and that's how he joined. You see, everything's about duplication. Gone are the days where we are taught an education, go to work, compete for that position. Don't tell everybody everything you know because they would then be competing for that same position. Here, as we started this call, is all about cooperation and collaboration using the skills, resources, experience, and stories of others while you gain yours. That's the power of a freeway call. I'd encourage you as you make your list and you identify those people you wanna to talk to about the product, potential customers. Learn how to position that by working with someone on the team as you want to start looking at people that potentially would make partner with you, make sure that initially your first five or 10 calls that you're lining them up for a three way. So someone else can go to work on your behalf to help you achieve those fast start bonuses in your first 30 to 60 days. I hope that was a value. Enjoy your time getting started and welcome to the team.